Hello, Archibald Chesterfield the third, AC3. Fuckers, AC3. And today I am um, doing paid reviews. Remember, like, subscribe, and tell your fuckhead friends. And uh, I gotta tell you the truth, there, fuckers. I'm having a little bit of licorice. I love this Coles generic licorice. I don't know what it is. I fucking love it. If I could open the cunt, fucking cunt, and I can open the cunt. This is, I don't know what it is. I'm addicted to raspberry fucking licorice. I don't know, I don't know what the hell is wrong with me. Especially this bad shitty colored. I don't know what's wrong with me, fuckers. Okay. Now, fuckers. Paid reviews. Mmm. Mmm. -hmm. This is a paid review, fuckers, because I don't do shit for fucking free, you cunts. Okay, let's jump into paid reviews, fuckers. Dear Archie, please keep my name anonymous. I sent you 20 US to your PayPal account. Love your work. My collection has hit a roadblock and I need your advice. I currently have an Amiga Speedmaster man on a fucking moon. Rolex Sea Dweller 4000. My next purchase will be a blue two-tone sub. Here's the problem. Fuck! I will have two Rolex dive watches. What are your thoughts on this? Was thinking to trade my Sea Dweller for a GMT Master 2 Batman or Black Ceramic. Then this will complete my collection having a chronograph, GMT, a diver. Please let me know what you think or if you have any other opinions, options for me. Cheers, anonymous fuckers, wowzers. What a dilemma. First world dilemmas, fuckers. First world. What do you fuckers think of that, hey, cunters? We specialize in the repair of Rolex and Patek Philippe watches. We've been doing the same thing for more than 25 years. We have a Rolex technician certified by Rolex who actually used to work for the company for many years, like if we do in the work on the factory. We completely disassemble the watch and we put it to work, like brand new condition. When you get the pre-owned watch, it's like if you're getting a brand new unit. The only difference is the money. Very good question. You got a uh, Amiga Speedmaster. Man on the fucking moon! Man on the fucking moon! That's a cool watch. Sea Dweller, cool. And you're going to get a two tone bluesy. Very, 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 very cool. Fuck is very cool. Okay, can I tell you this? You know, I went through the same dilemma. I had two subs. I had a no date steel stunner and I had the solid gold solid gold Rolex Submariner and I thought oh no no I can't do it I can't do it but look just stop they are very different just like the two tone and the no date oh sorry the two tone and the sea dweller two different watches if I was you slow the fuck down you don't have to form conform to any rules from circle jerkers I sold my no date and got an explorer too okay do I regret it yes and no I love my explorer too it is so damn cool it is cool it is fucking super cool it's very cool however the no date sub fuck was that cool it looks so good on a NATO it was cool okay I do Regret it, okay? I regret it. I regret it because I had to follow stupid rules like you've got. Man, if I were you, you know what I'd do, uh, Anonymous? Work a bit harder! Add, add a Explorer 2. Keep them all. Just work a bit harder. There are no rules in life. The Batman's a bit expensive. Ceramics are a bit expensive. Get, get, get a 
Explorer 2, keep what you've got. I sold it off and I really regret it, okay? I mean, I regret it because, I mean, I, I love my Explorer 2, but the no date sub I had, just like your Sea Dweller, so cool. So cool, okay? Shouldn't have sold it. I was. I was stupid because I was trying to fit into rules and this and that. Who gives a fuck? Life is for living, not for some circle jerker to tell you what to do. So, uh, personally, don't sell it. Keep it. Keep it. I've been there myself. I, I did what you did. I balanced the collection and I look back and think, oh, silly to get rid of that no data. That's what I, I do. I look back and say, ah. Oh. So, uh, my opinion, don't do it. Just keep what you got. Add the Explorer 2 down the track. That's a much better idea, man. I'm Archibald Chesterfield III, AC3. Keep working, keep saving. I love you all. Please keep watching. Like, subscribe, and tell your fuckhead friends about the channel. See you later, fuckers. Nasty vinyl fuckers. Yeah.